Hey, Bastish PF for 64K and welcome to vlog number 7. Welcome to 64K. Hosted by Bass Tish B. And welcome back. If you've never watched one of these vlogs, this is just me giving a rundown on all the shows I've got coming out for the current month. This is all the shows for August. So first up, tomorrow I've got another episode of Loot and Booty. That's my thrifting show. I went around and I went to a lot of places this time. I've got a lot of video game pickups. Really cool stuff for dirt cheap. At the end of this episode, I go to the store. It's a classic board game store. It also has retro video games. Really cool place. Little hole in the wall. So I'll show that also. So you should check out that video. It comes out tomorrow. Got a whole bunch of episodes of Wide for Sound coming out. Those videos are released every Friday. If you don't know, it's like the example over there. It's kind of like a celebration of the soundtrack of a video game. I take my favorite track. I put some footage there, some info about the game. And yeah, it's just quick and easy, quick, fun little videos to watch. You can highlight a lot of uh, awesome video game soundtracks you may not ever have heard before. As per usual, I've got a whole lot of Commodore 64 games highlighted. I've also got a lot of uh, old arcade games as well, so check those ones out every Friday. I've also got a bunch of episodes of my Rapid Fire program coming out. That's where I do small little reviews, two minutes, two and a half max. So quick bite-sized chunks you can watch on your phone at work. Sneak it at work anyway. <laughs> and uh, I covered a bunch of games that I don't see a lot of coverage of, so uh, I've been wanting to do these ones for quite a while. So uh, they're pretty interesting. You should uh, definitely check those out. They'll be spread out over the whole month. I've also got another big episode of Opening the Shinies. That's my unboxing video series. And uh, I've got another massive haul of Commodore 64 games. So this is going to be very, very cool. Um, I'm going to start editing that video actually tomorrow. I'm just finishing off some other stuff. That's going to be later in the month. There are a lot of really cool games in this one package. You just, uh, you just have to wait and see. Tons of cool footage of all the games so you can get a good example of what they like if you've never played them before. I've also got the follow-up to my Let's Play a series video. This is part two of the Epics game series. If you didn't see the first one, I covered all classic Epics games. The Epics game series, you know, the ones from 1984 to 1986. Those were like Summer Games, Summer Games 2, Winter Games, World Games. And part two, which is coming out right in the middle of the month, I'm right at the end of editing it. It's, uh, it's a lot of content in there, <laughs> and uh, I'm almost there. That video is going to come out probably the middle of the month, and that one is going to cover 1987 and 1988. So you've got California games, uh, Game Summer Edition, Games Winter Edition, and a full retrospective on the whole series. So look out for that one. It's a big video. I hope you're going to enjoy it. And another big video I've got coming out right near the end of the month is from the How To series. I'm going to show you how to use DOSBox, or more importantly, how to load a game in DOSBox. So if you've ever been intimidated by playing old PC games and just wasn't really sure how or how to get into it, or just want to know like the basics of DOSBox just to load a game, that's exactly what I'm going to show you. There's going to be no other, you know, I'm not going to go into mega detail on anything else. There'll be a little little tips here and there about DOSBox but basically I'm just going to show you the whole process of loading a game because that's what most people want to do. Also discuss a whole bunch of resources for old PC gaming so if you've ever wanted to get into that kind of thing then this is a video to watch. Here's a quick shout out to everybody that's become a subscriber recently. I appreciate it. Every little bit helps. It's slowly going up. I'm very happy with it. Um, everybody that's watched the videos and commented, I appreciate that very much. Believe me, it makes it feel like it's worth it. And uh, even though I get satisfaction myself from just making them, it's still is a, it's, it's very gratifying. Anyway, a particular shout out has to go out to a guy that has his own YouTube channel. He's called Savage Gaming over there. See that logo with that crazy mask? 
Anyway, this guy, he's also got his own YouTube channel, he does retro gaming, he recently became a subscriber, he's very cool, the site is excellent, I really like it a lot, it covers a lot of games that I particularly like, and you know, style that is cool and it's really well made, uh, he's got very low subscriptions as well, just like me, so if you want to see a good uh, channel that uh, a lot of people probably don't even know about, check out Savage Gaming. Look for uh, that mask though, uh, there's a lot of uh, channels called Savage or Savage Gaming, so don't get confused, there's a lot of rubbish ones out there, but just look for that logo and you're good to go. Also thanks to everybody on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram who always send good messages and uh, share my stuff, especially the guys on Twitter, you know who you are, you always uh, retweet my stuff, I appreciate that a lot, it helps, helps me out. I uh, don't want to mention your names, but you don't have proper sites, you just uh, guys that like the videos, so you know who you are, I uh, appreciate it a lot, it's very cool. And if you didn't already know, I'm on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter, there's a lot of extra content up there that isn't on my YouTube channel, so if you want to see extra stuff, I also do a series called the Minivid series, which uh, little bite-sized gameplay chunks of uh, awesome games, a lot of them I haven't covered on my, my actual YouTube channel yet, so uh, they probably will be in the future. And that about wraps up this vlog, I just want to keep it short and sweet, I uh, appreciate everybody that's been watching, and thanks for joining me, Bastish B at 64k, if you could like and subscribe if you haven't already, that would be awesome, and with that, let's cut credits!